Let's talk about the pillars talk on Friday called Staggered Development. I'm Ars Drake and this is my channel. Over the past two days I've been hearing how disappointing the video has been. Not talking about content but complaining about how difficult it is to finish the patches and patch them up. However, I found the video very interesting as it comes to the features as far as possible finished and stable in the game to bring. So what is mean by staggered development? Therefore the teams will split in two halves. Where one, of, uh, one team will work on the current patch, for example now patch 3.7, while the other half works on patch 3.8. If the team 3.7 finishes work, it moves on to the patch 3.9. This extends the development time by 3 months and gives the teams a tot uh, total of 6 months to complete the patches. The evocative fa uh, phase and the PTU phase extends also and the bug fixing should work better. Will it change something for us? Will it mean that the patches only comes every 6 months? We keeping getting a patch every three months, but it sh should now be more stable and almost finish, uh, almost finish with finished features. Of course, some points of su uh, patch 3.7 uh, shifts now in later patches until the teams are in rhythm with the sub uh, subsequent patches. But we have received some things that were not on the roadmap, like the caves and the FPS mining. What, uh, what is about the vehicle pipeline? Nothing. The teams already work in this way. This whole method not only makes the patches more stable, but also benefits the development itself. As both games, Star Citizen and Squadron 42, share the same source code and have the features added to the other title after completion. How do you see this? Could we benefit from it or not? Write me a comment under this video, otherwise subscribe my channel, leave me a thumb up and click on the bell to stay up to date. Until the next time, RS Drake.